Welcome to Symbol Tech Working Bench. Welcome back guys to another video. And uh, today I'm quite happy. It's time for a mailbag video because today I receive all these parcels. So one, two, three, four. And I'm really curious what is in the big one over here. And shall I say, let's start with the first one, which is uh, trying to choose the smallest one. So this one, and let's see what's inside. So let me grab my knives around here. So I have a knife over there. And let's see what we have inside of this uh, this one. So I can just try to cut from here. And oh, there is a bunch of papers here. Everything is right on Chinese. And I cannot understand what's inside. Ah, here is telling me that is uh, X Y W R B T plus Y K color with remote control, one piece. Please try to send fast this order. I really need urgently this product. Thank you. So, I think he moved very fast. I sent this message to him because I remember I don't order too long time ago this stuff. So practically, if I am in the middle of building my amplifier, I want to add inside also a Bluetooth option that uh, sometimes also my wife should like to listen some music and uh, it can be easy to just uh, connect the mobile with the Bluetooth connection and you can uh, stream your music from your mobile without to connect via cables ah, the normal uh, chip remote control and if it's this one here definitely come also with the battery and I'm really curious to see if this battery already in but if they want that one for sure should be a battery no the battery is not it's working with two batteries I think I have some place some batteries like that so let's see how it looks the board so the board looks neat nice the Bluetooth connection the antenna the output uh, output uh, signal and I can also use just this output signal here you can see there is output left and right channel and ground remote control communicate with this uh, receiver then it's powered by USB or I can power with 3.7 up to 24 volts hmm. that's really shock up to 24 volts I can put in this board Hmm, that's nice. Okay, so leave it here. Let's have a look uh, from where I get this board, how much I paid, and how fast they was they was with the shipping this one over to me. Is this one here? Yeah. So it's Bluetooth audio receiver board, Bluetooth five. 0 mp3 lossless decoder bar wireless stereo music module y x y w r b t with remote control and i paid two pounds 31 uh, 23 pence 
let's see if they have and if they are selling still so the store name is shop 912692 and with shipping I pay three pounds and six pence let's see if they are still selling this board so they are selling still so if you want to purchase you go add the cart actually they have two models they have this model without remote control that you can control everything from this uh, this knob here and let's see the difference between one so this one is costing two pounds 33 and this one cost two pounds 90 and plus one dollar shipping let me put the price on in pounds because it's showing dollars so gbp here let's save so in pounds the price is uh, this one without remote control one pound 84 and the one with the remote control two pounds 28 plus 0 83 shipping so yeah if you like to have one just try it and you're gonna see if it's working okay so now we're going to give a try to see if it's working this is what i like because in case if it's defective i can show the video to the seller and I can tell that uh, doesn't work how it should work so let's bring some power from the USB so I'm gonna plug the power over here okay the lights are on so uh, let me try to see also with this headset and the power and let's find the device right so let me go to my Bluetooth and let's turn on and let's try to find this one More X Y this one should be okay and looks like I have sound that is connected let me now try to yeah looks like uh, he's doing a nice sound just let me put the so yeah it's good that it's working yeah working good so yeah and also the sound is very pure nice is not with too much distortion like how I can heard on my on my uh, headset so yeah I'm happy with that purchase and definitely it will gonna find the place in the amplifier that I'm working on let's go the next thing it's a small one also this one so let's have a look what is because here description is everything in Chinese so I cannot understand what they try to explain so let's have a look there's two things inside oh yeah for a long time ago I ordered once two OLED display it didn't show up I get refund I apply again to buy once and finally I get them so yeah because I have this one here 
that is still in project is my that uh, soldering station that I'm doing with uh, with the uh, uh, STM32 and I need uh, only display because I have only one around that I'm using for for uh, projects demonstrations and if I do a project I need a new one so I buy two one should be a blue and one should be a white so yeah let's now see so this one is telling me that is a blue this one should be the white yeah the white so let's have a look how much I pay for these two and from when I get them so let me also open one because I've bought the same to see how they are I think it's a communication I2 square are tiny are very good for my project with the soldering station so I have a video when I was doing the demo on a breadboard I'm gonna put the video over here that you can have it and also I'm gonna put it down in the description and you can watch it uh, it's really nice working good and yeah I just needed the, the OLED display to do also that project when it's coming properly made it on the PCB board and everything or the holder here and yeah stay tuned soon it's gonna come also that project on so let's see how much I pay how long they took to come here so the Bluetooth module I forget to tell uh, how long it takes so I order it on uh, 5th, 5th of October and he's got it here on 23rd so mm, 18 days 19 days like that and then now let's see the OLED displays so OLED display I, I brought it in the same time and they move very fast Total for two, I paid three pounds thirty-one, and I think was shipping, free shipping or shipping included. Yeah, no, it was some shipping. So let's have a look how much they are selling right now. So right now they are selling. If you go to choose which color you want, so I ordered the white one. The white one is uh, one pound twenty-three plus the zero eighty-two shipping. And if you order multiples, it will not charge more than that uh, amount for the shipping because it will gonna put everything in one. So I buy those one, and I think uh, this is blue and yellow, and the blue, pure blue, and the same price. Yeah, all the yellow is quite more expensive, and blue and yellow also more expensive. So yeah, I brought it from. Uh, which store so if i go back here it will gonna tell me the store so store name win win yeah so if you like one very cheap and as i say i need for that project with my soldering station that i'm going to to make it okay so let's go with the next one win it's just quite big but inside doesn't feel to be something bigger so let's have a look what's inside of this one inside of this one there is another one but a different thing so even here no description no nothing maybe there, there is and Chinese yeah Chinese everything Chinese let's have a look what's staying here it's strange so let's have a look what's inside so oh yeah so this one is the same for the amplifier project because it's a emi filter so they're gonna reduce the noise and all the noise that come from the ac mains so practically you can here in with the earth and two and then you go to 
to the load to the amplifier so I have also this one that I can clamp cable yeah so this one come very fast and I can go over with my amplifier project to be very low noise so yeah let's see how much I pay for this one and from where and also the timing that takes to be here okay so this one comes in from AliExpress let's have a look where it is so is this one AC purification 220 volt single phase power supply filter emi anti-interface purification audio CW1BTB21A3A6A A. Ah, so those one are the, uh, the, the load that you can apply so there is 1 ampere, 3 ampere, 6 ampere and 10 amps so I buy the one of 10 amps so the load is 10, uh, 10 amps so looks like it was free shipping if I think because I paid 200, 2 pounds 90 pence and the pieces call me the same price I ordered in the same day on 5th of October and they move very fast to here. Let's see if they're still selling. So they are still selling, same with free shipping, £2.87. How much I pay for? £2.90. So it's cheaper right now than how much I pay. And the seller is Zhang Tong Zheng Electric. So yeah, it's a nice one and you need to choose each one you like and I choose the 10 amps which is this one and if I go to check again yeah, the one of 10, 10 amps and the price is cheaper right now yeah, if you like to have one to mount in your amplifier to reduce the noise it's very really useful and the bigger surprise, the last one for today is the big parcel over here. This is say that is a gift, Kadiao. And commercial sample, Ekijan collection. Huh? Quality and detail description content. Quantity declaration detail content in France. Say the value, huh? the oscilloscope and the value eight pounds eight dollars hmm. i think i pay more on that so maybe they put that value in order if it's passing through the custom to don't charge you the custom uh, charge okay so we know now this is that the an oscilloscope Let's try to dig in so and to see how that looks. Okay. So it's the how to read how to read because it's all opposite. On moon. Actually, should be typed like that. O one, because I was looking and was calling O one here. They put it how it needs to be O one meeting your needs. But here, the even if you want to read it like that or like that, I don't know how they type it here. But here is something wrong. So is the. BSD1022 model because I was looking for a oscilloscope that I can have a big screen so the biggest oscilloscope the professionals want they are really costing so I'm not in that budget yet because I'm doing like as a hobby and as I said I'm not earning any money from this stuff just I'm doing for myself to just to share with you guys if someone is interested how to do project and stuff like that just subscribe to my channel if you are new watching this video activate the notification bell to receive my notification when I'm posting new videos and as I say there is lots of projects coming in soon 
one my, one of my friends he sent me also over a, a pioneer equalizer and so he wants me to give an upgrade so to change the power supply to change the op amps to make it uh, because it's quite old and to make it to be with the new generation of op amps i still might have my own amplifier that is in project and the video which will gonna come soon I have, as I said, also this one that it will gonna come soon. The soldering station and few other bits and pieces. Ah, I have also this too. Let me show you. So I have two amplifier boards here that I need to try also as well. Are the Jean Hiraga Le Monster and then. Another amplifier over here, that also this one I need to make a comparison to see which one sound better, these ones or these ones. Yeah, I have few projects coming in soon also. Uh, <clears throat> now let's go back to this one. So I buy this one because I have just one like for the hobby, a small, very small one with a small display, so it's quite difficult to see the the, 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 the the display because it's quite small and also when I was doing some videos very difficult to see the line here so I was looking to buy this one that you can connect via USB to your computer or laptop and you try to see everything on the on the laptop display and it's quite we're gonna be like the screen of the display and also it's easy for me like that when I'm doing also some video just to record the, the desktop and to show the, 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 the oscilloscope readings so without further ado let's dig in and to see what is inside the box so inside the box we have the oscilloscope itself which is quite light it's not heavy and has two channels channel 1 channel 2 one may go maximum 40 volts peak to peak oh it's a good one this is without any attenuation on the on the on the probes then this multi i'm gonna see what does do and i have here the probes that is one kilohertz five volts and looks like he has here rubber legs that it will then stay like that on your table. And at the back we have the USB connection. And that's not nothing more than that. So as the unit. Then the unit comes with a bunch of stuff here. So we have the TV or the software for that, but I think I'm gonna go to download the latest version from from online. And the manual, user manual. And it's telling you which models they have still more. But they have also 14 bits, so this is just 8 bit and 40 megs, 40 megs. This is 25 megs by the way. Yeah, some models of oscilloscopes here and definitely yeah see this is the model that they have here vds1022 has 25 megahertz 100 millisecond for the uh, for the screenshot uh, screen capturing and yeah so is telling you how to use it, definitely how to install the software, how to connect and have all the steps that you need. And yeah, so this one can go back on the bag. Voila. Then 
I'm gonna put back here. So you have the USB connection because you need to connect to your laptop. And is a strong cable. It's a good one. It's not a because all the power comes through your laptop, it will not have an external power supply. So everything is powered by your PC, so no need external power supply for this. And then here we have the empty box, let's just, we'll get rid of. Here we have the probes. So. Uh, that one we're gonna be open it. Don't tell me that I need to broken. No, it's like a zip one. Yes, so we have the probes. They are 100 megahertz probes, and there should be two of them. And you have also the bag with the screwdriver that you need to calibrate the probes. It. Uh, colors that you can put on the probes to identify which channel you are following and this stuff yeah that's good and here are the probes itself so here is the connection I like that is insulated it's not properly open that you can touch it then cable it's really flexible here you have 1x 10x and then you have the proper which is really good it's not that bad quality and the ground which is also this one insulated it's nice have the ground clipper and where is the Attenu attenuation because you should have the screw that you can attenuate. So why you cannot attenuate straight away from here? No, that's strange. So I know that should be a place where you put your screwdriver to regulate your oh don't tell me that this one they don't have. Because the one that I have on the other oscilloscope, let me just bring it and show it. You can see from here, I can calibrate the, 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 the oscilloscope. I can just turn that on until the, 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 the probe reading good. And by the way, this one looks better than that one's. Also, the quality is quite better yeah looks better quality only that is not insulated here but see i can calibrate the probe it's this one so they don't have maybe i need to remove this cover i don't know i need just to understand anyway they look nice let's see from where i buy it and how long needed to get it here and then maybe I'm gonna install the software and I'm gonna give a try to see if it's working like that if it's something defect I have a proof to the seller to say well it's something wrong with it so let's go to see from where I buy this nice oscilloscope so this oscilloscope I purchased it from eBay I find it on an offer. So if I go to my orders, it's this one. So I find it in an offer which I pay £64.34 and 34 pence with free shipping. I ordered it on 15th October and less than 10 days came here. And I purchased from Rilohas. So let's see if he's still selling this item. So, so they are still selling with 64 pounds and 34. How much I pay? 
was the same price. 64.34. Yeah, they're still selling with the same price. And they say that it's free service from outside the UK. But when I purchased it, it was telling me that it's a UK seller and it's shipping from UK. Let's have a look what we can say about this one. So, description. So, Siloco is a dual channel design, one which 25 megahertz and sample rate 100 milliseconds. The oscilloscope is PC has 5K register length. User friendly design of the user interface. Blah, 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 blah. blah things that you need to so maxing 10m record length oh, that's good and here are the things that he can do here what's is inside of the package and oh see here is shared that it's from Shenzhen, from China. When I brought, I was looking for the UK sellers because I wanted to come fast. But anyway, if you come from China, one week here, and with this uh, small price, that's very good. So, if you are interested, you can go and visit the uh, Relojas. 143 and you can buy one so just for demo i'm gonna use my laptop and i'm gonna try to install to be more fast everything from the cd but then for my computer where i'm using uh, for my project and stuff like that i'm gonna go to install the last uh, version software from online so let's have a look what we have here so cd in and let's see what we get from there so open folder So we have VDS oscilloscope, series bench modelizer. So I think this one I need to open. USB driver installed. So let's have a look what the instruction telling me that I need to do for first. So quick way guide. Safety terms, blah 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 blah. So port intro, port introduction, trigger. Okay, how to prevent the general inspection? Check blah blah blah. Check check how we need to do so. How to connect with this? So install the Swift software. So, double click to create desktop short, uh, shortcuts. Install the, so first then we need to go with the software. So, I think it's in, should be I think here. So, 1022 should be this one, because mine is 1022. Let's see. Yeah, 
Right, so double click on install. Yes, for sure they want an English, the only English version they have. Okay, next, next, install. And let's wait to install everything. So this laptop is quite old, it's not anymore new, but it's still doing the things. So let's have a look how it looks the software. Hello access, yes. So here is the enemy sun things, capture period, trigger, keyboard, and blah blah. So the size of it's good, but maybe. So yeah, I can make it bigger, I can make it full screen, yeah, that's full screen, at the sanded board. Windows cannot find, reinstall bot, make sure you type the name correctly and try again, Whoa. Then, what the book say, after we done that, it said that use the supply USB cable to connect it, so I went in now to connect, so I have a USB port on this side. What time I use this one now for the moment, here, I have a USB port over there. So I go with that one. And Let's connect it to see what's happening here. Okay, installing the driver. Any lights to show me? Yeah, there is a light over here that is blinking, it's a red one. Let's have a look if it will gonna install the driver. Let's click on and see what's happening over there. Device driver not inst was not successful installed. So So then what we need to do? USB drive installed with in the document install the driver. So how to implement function inspection? Hmm. So let's find now the driver. So, so I managed to install everything. I installed the software and uh, and the driver. I find it online very easy. I went to the online page, and from here you can download everything from this very easy so you have the software and you have the the USB drivers here USB driver for VDS series for oscilloscopes I have also ma user manual user manual and so on so you can find very easy also in the website everything and here is up and running so let me put on trigger, also alternate both of the channels and then then it's easy because if you want you can add things like for measure you can remove, look from the channel 1 I'm removing these ones let's see I want just to know the RMS so I'm keeping only the RMS here on display and I'm using the Function generator, which is 
this one. So I set up on 50 hertz over here and thanks to Vishal Kedna that made me this gift so he recently gave it to me so he's a good friend but also he brings me some work over sometimes I need I make so that's why I say that that pioneer project is gonna be for him so I need to work uh, for to make it for him so stay tuned yet yeah, because it will gonna come also that project soon and here you have also the screwdriver that is uh, should be plastic not metal in order that you don't interfere with the the signal so looks like came a bit of noisy and you can see the line has lots of spikes over here maybe because I have the power on so if I remove the power and leave it to run on in the battery let's see if it's something changing so it's like a little of the spikes they go in special for here that is attach it only from here because this one is still attached to 220 and if I remove it some spikes they go if I plug it also the power supply let's have a look if it's coming more see we have more spikes with power supply Let's put the triangle, let's put the square one. So they say that it's uh, 2 volts for division. So if it's 2 volts for division, so from here to down I have 1 volt something. From here to here 1 volt something because it's not properly in 2. And if I go up exactly to touch the edges then we notice two volts it is getting me more it's three volts so where is the two volts ah because i was going with two divisions so yeah it should be four volts two divisions so there i should have four volts it's almost there yeah then I have four volts. That is overcrossing a bit the division. So yeah, it's a good one. Yeah, this is what all the mailbag for today. I hope you enjoyed. And looks like it's running. So here I have the one kilohertz square wave. So you can see it's measuring square wave. So let me just first attach the ground and let's disconnect the channel 2 from here channel 1 powering this one off and I'm going just to do the trigger mode only the channel 2 single and little for channel 2 close this one and if I do automatic it needs to scale me in order to see good see it scale me that I can see the, the frequency perfectly and the square wave it's really good so it doesn't have too many spikes if I remove this one I need to switch over this one and if I go to set up a bit the I need to trim a bit the in order to get a perfect square because see if I go like that I destroying and if I go to this side I'm destroying as well so I think here is the perfect square not a little bit more something there so yeah it's a good oscilloscope so 
Thanks guys for watching. I hope you don't get bored and I hope that you enjoy this. If you are new to this video, please subscribe, activate the notification bell. I have more projects coming in soon. And what to say? See you for the next video. Bye bye for now.